Hey YouTube, BR Tidwell 55 here. Uh, today we're going to talk a little bit about uh, some desktop effects that are available in Cinnamon. Now, Cinnamon, I I'm sure you all remember uh, a couple years ago, you know, when, uh, well, maybe more than a couple years ago. Anyway, when Compiz Fusion came out, you know, it it had all these great desktop effects like the cube and uh, wobbly windows and the like and uh, when Cinnamon came out it came with its own uh, compositing engine which unfortunately which isn't compatible uh, with uh, with Compiz, but the the people who develop Cinnamon and the community around it have they're they're starting to bring some of that some of those effects back, and and you and you can get them like I just show I just showed you uh, the new uh, cube. It's not as cool as Compiz's cube, but I'm sure with a little bit more work it'll get there and you can get your uh, your your cover flow window switcher type window uh, type window switcher and uh, let's see there's also a more traditional type window switcher built in like you'd find in say Windows 7 and what was the other one hit control out down arrow and you can choose between windows that way as well sort of an, I think that's expo so and of course you've got your that your minimize and maximize effects unfortunately you know that it's not what I would say. It's not as what I would call as polished as comp is, but it's getting there. And you know, it actually does give you some uh, some functionality. I think back to your desktop, and it looks cool. Uh, okay, how do you get them? Well, let's see here. Let me switch back to uh, go over here to the control uh, over here to the control panel. This is in themes. Uh, I've showed you this uh, before, but we're going to go back to all settings. And under all set, uh, under the system settings, you see extensions. And 3D App Switcher is the one that's giving. It's actually giving me. Don't paint. Some of these work better than others. This CoverFlow Alt Tab. I've never been able to get that to work, but I'm getting the same effect with the 3D App Switcher, and that's what's doing that. And I changed the default uh, key map. You can configure this. And the default key map for switching windows is uh, Control Alt Escape. I I just to change that key map, you just click on that and then uh, press the keys that you want to uh, make that work. And you can go from a cover flow style or a timeline style. And I'll show you what that looks like. That's the timeline kind of Windows 70 right there. I think I actually prefer the cover flow, so I'm going to switch that. I'm going to change that back. Yeah, I think that looks better. Uh Go back to all settings. Go back to extensions again. Uh And you get these on the get more online tab you'll have to hit refl uh, refresh and you can see all of these extensions that are available as you can see I've got the desktop uh, I'll go back to installed I have desktop cube and wobbly windows installed Woo, wobbly windows everybody thought that was so cool when it first came out with Compass uh, as far as as far as themes go, that's where I originally was. Uh, here's the, all the themes I've installed. Right now, I'm using 
best of dark and that gives me this uh, transparent uh, panel down here and sort of a dark transparent uh, menu uh, customize other settings is on the other settings tab and I'm using a, a windows icon set uh, the window borders uh, the default comes with theme best dark I'm using that uh, you can change you can install different theme packs for mouse pointers and uh, and icons as well and controls that's what like these sub menus that 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 controls what your sub menus look like uh, I like this look I could pr I've got some darker themes in here I could probably try but we'll just change one uh, try Zornate black see what that looks like yeah that's kinda scary I don't like uh, I'm not a big fan of that it looks a little bit better but I'm not a fan of all of all of this business with the with the borders between options so I'll just go back to the uh, Ubuntu OS X controls and I think that looks a little bit better uh, would really like uh, if anybody's watching this and knows how to how to build these uh, GTK uh, 3.x themes one thing I miss is you're not able uh, you're not able to use emerald themes uh, emerald depends on compiz and compiz is not compatible with cinnamon but I really miss the transparent borders I actually like that so somebody could figure out how to do that I am all ears I would love to make these window borders transparent uh well that's about it uh this is BR Ted Wolf 55 thanks for watching